Good day everyone, this is Jake Rodriguez Pomperada from Bacolod City, Negros Occidental, Philippines. In this tutorial video, we will learn how to create a program that will ask three numbers from the users and then our program will check and determine which of the three numbers has a biggest value using visualbasic.net. Before we started, if you like this tutorial video, click the like button leave a comment in the comment section of this video tutorial and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming video tutorial so let's get started here we have here the form one in our visual basic.net integrated development editor we will change the text in our form one into we will create a title biggest of three numbers in vb.net this is the title of our program the next step that we will do is to go to our toolbox and then we will have here a label label click this label and drag to our form and then we will change this one to enter first value we will change it to the font Arial font style regular the size is 12 I will copy this label two times and then here we will change this one into second and then the third this area the third label into third okay after we are through, we will proceed to our toolbox again and select the text box. Click and drag. Now, we will change this, the font size to Arial. Uh -huh. Regular and then the size will be 12. I will copy this one. Okay, we can adjust the spacing in between text boxes. We can use the arrow key you know, of our keyboard. Okay, after we are through, we will have here a button. Click, okay, select the button in the toolbox and then drag to our form okay so in our form we will check we will select the we will change rather the font Arial bold the size will be 12 and then the text we will change this the word check okay next we will copy this form paste here by the, this second button we will have to clear the purpose of clear button is to clear the text box and then I will copy in again and then we will have the third button in the third button we will have the word quit to quit the program it allows the user to terminate the program or stop running the program we double click and then we just put the command end to end our program ok so back in our form we will double click the check button and then we will do some coding in this portion so dim a b and c 
this is the three variables that hold the value of text box 1, text box 2, and text box 3. And then I will assign it as integer whole number, positive and negative, including 0. It is considered as integer. So a equals val text box 1 point text copy and we have b text box 2 and then we will have also variable c text box 3 ok we will have some comparison here if a greater than b variable b and uh, a greater than variable c then message box a is bigger bigger value okay next we will have else if so else if b greater than a and uh, b greater than C then the, the bigger value in this second comparison is B the third else the bigger is C put uh, that okay we are we are very true uh, done already with the coding in the section here of the comparison so this is the conditional statement for to check which of the three numbers is bigger okay after we have done we just proceed with the clear text box in the clear text box we can put here text box 1 point x text box 2 point x clear text box 3 and then we will copy this one the text box 1 and then we replace with focus so in this example okay so we are already through now let us check our program by running click this start button let's say for example one two and three okay so we have yet now three is the bigger value click ok clear 56 45 
so 78 is bigger value okay clear 400 200 500 click the check button 500 is the bigger value here we go guys uh, we are already done creating a program in visual basic dot net that will uh, that will ask the user to give three numbers and then our program will check which of the three numbers has a bigger numerical value if you like this video tutorial please click the like button leave a comment in the comment section of this video tutorial and subscribe to my channel for more video tutorials until next time guys bye bye for now